Oh my, oh my goodness, did I use too much? I would like to get to know Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As you guys read the title of today's video, I'm going to be attempting and semi-failing and then succeeding towards the end following a UK girly and following her step-by-step -step tutorial on how she does her makeup. And if y'all know one thing, one thing, when it comes to the UK girls, they eat down on their makeup and they don't play when it comes to their lace, okay? When it comes to those two, they are unmatched, unbeatable, okay? So today's video is me attempting, failing, and then succeeding <laughs> doing my makeup by following her step-by-step -step tutorial. So in a way, you can say I'm doing my makeup like the UK girlies. Is there any difference? Mm, not so much. Further along in the video, you're gonna see where I failed a little bit, and you're probably gonna be like, damn, you look ghostly, bitch. But as we can see, I fixed it. So if you guys are interested, then keep on watching. So I just freshly washed my face. And I'm gonna go ahead and moisturize with the La Roche Posay. Um, and if you guys see me looking down because my phone is right over here because I screen recorded the TikTok user who's um tutorial so I'm gonna be following this I don't know if you guys can see this is her right over here I think her name is Kay on TikTok so I screen recorded the whole thing so let's follow it to the T shall we okay so she went and primed her face first using the beauty hydrating primer I do not have such primer Speaking of primer, where are my primers? Hello. She went and primed her face using the Huda Beauty Hydrating Primer. I don't have that primer, so I'm going to use my e.l.f. Power Grip Primer. Such a good one. I've been too much. I've just also gone in with And I'm using the e.l.f. Power Grip Primer, and I'm literally putting it over my entire face, okay? Under my eyes, top of my forehead, everywhere because apparently Miss Mama gets real sticky as we can see. I'm gonna also go ahead and um, moisturize my lips. I'm using the I'm using the Bigelow Mentha Lip Shine. You can get this from Bath and Body Works, I believe. But when you go, please don't buy all of them, okay? I'm, I'm already having a hard time trying to find some. And every time I see one, two, or however many they have, I have to buy all of them. Because I'm guessing the girlies are just now catching on, but uh-uh. This, this is my jam right here. And my mirror is right over here, so in case you guys see me look in this direction, my mirror is right in this direction. Um, she also did go in with the Urban Decay eyeshadow primer on her smile lines and on her under eyes, because apparently it helps with creasing. I don't have that or an eyeshadow primer for that matter. So we're gonna skip that step. I need the max queen. Okay, so next she goes and she sets her primers with, I think like a Huda Beauty face primer. I forgot what name she said, cause I'm trying to pay attention and do stuff at the same time. But I'm going to be using my Makeup Revolution and Banana Lights. And I'm also gonna do the same steps in the same particular areas because she has oily T-zone, I have an oily T-zone. And pretty much, I think I'm just gonna set my entire face, babe. She even did her under eyes. So, I'm gonna do the same thing. And I believe this step helps with oiliness. Set under. She 
I'm gonna really go in on the nose because that's literally my biggest problem area. And then she sets using, I believe it's with the Charlotte Tilbury Vitamin E setting spray, but I'm gonna use the Makeup Revolution Super Fix and Super Hold Misting Spray, Ultra Matte Finish with aloe and vitamin E. Okay, so after she set her primer and powder, she goes in with the Too Faced and Soft Matte. I don't have that. I'm gonna use the Lancome Tante Idol Ultra Wear in the shade 450 W. Okay, she's using the sponge, but I'm gonna use, should I follow it to the T and use a sponge? You know what, BRB, I'm gonna follow it to the T and use a sponge. Okay, so I just wet my sponge and I'm squeezing out the excess water because I don't want <laughs> to ruin anything I've done on my face, but I need to blend it very quickly. So, trying to stay away from the under eye. And I did notice she didn't put any foundation on her forehead, but I did. So I'm gonna just, you know, keep on going. And, and my particular opinion, I may not be a sponge girly. I may be a brush girly. So, because of course sponges, they pick up majority of the product. So I'm just gonna go back in with just a pinch, a pinch more, just a pinch. And then blend it out with the brush because brushes give you more full of coverage anyways. And I'm a full coverage girl. Yeah. Now, although I'm not gonna be following her video to the T with products. I am going to be following her video to the T with techniques. Okay. Now she did just say she's um she's going in with her first layer of concealer. So as of lately, I've been using my Alani concealers. Now all the shades that I have in the Milani concealers are 150, 145, 130, and 120. So I'm gonna use, mm, I think I'm going with 145 today. I'm gonna apply it the same way she did as well. Out here. And just a disclaimer if you guys hear any snoring, my dogs, okay? They're getting their afternoon nap in. Must be nice. I'm forehead, like side lip, like shit. I'm gonna do you. And then she says she brightens up with two more shades of concealer. Oh, and she went ham with concealer too. So hold up. Let me go ahead and go crazy. And she says she starts blending out the edges first before she gets into the center. So let's. And she's blending her under eye her. So let's blend the edges. So she went in with her second shade of concealer. So let me go ahead and 
fetch up and blend out the edges. Blend, blend, blend. How are we looking, y'all? How is it looking? Okay, so now she's adding another layer of concealer. So she uses three different shades of concealer. I, I said I'm going to be following it to the T. So. Okay, so to contour, I'm going to be using the Black Opal True Color Stick Foundation in the suede Mocha. And for the brush, I'm going to be using the Real Techniques 241. This is the Seamless Complexion Brush. So let me go ahead and get some of the product on the bristles. And just... Uh. How's it looking? I feel like I need to do some more blending. Let's go ahead and blend, blend, blend. Blend, blend, blend. What y'all think? How do we look? 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 Is he giving? Is he giving warm and bronze goddess? Okay, so the next shade for concealer that I'm going to go in with is going to be 130. Hold up, let me. Ooh, them dogs are sleepy. I'm gonna let this sit for a second. Matter of fact, I don't have to. Okay, because please. All right, that should have been long enough. Now let's go ahead and blend out the eyes. Let's go ahead and start off with the edges like she says she does. And then for her blood, she uses the LA Pro Conceal and like an orange peachy, but I don't have that. And I don't have anything peachy at all. And as of lately, I haven't been liking um, pinky blushes. I don't know what's going on with me, but I haven't been liking them. All right, so we're gonna just go ahead and skip over the blush. Cause like I said, I don't really like blood. Well, I don't have a peachy blush. So next is going to be her applying her third layer of concealer. I feel like that's OD. But we're gonna follow this to the team. So the third layer is going to be shade 120. So let's go ahead and put a dollop. That should be dry enough. Let's go ahead and blend out the inner corners. Okay, and then she sprays her face with the Urban Decay Vitamin E. And I'm gonna go ahead and spray my face with the revolution. Okay, so now that my face is all dry, she went in with the Charlotte Tilbury, but Miss Mamas don't got Charlotte Tilbury, so Miss Mamas is gonna use the NYX Professional Finishing Powder. And this is in banana. 
Fingers crossed, y'all. Fingers crossed. That's <laughs> because I'm nervous because this is actually my first time using this. It was going to be between this and the Fit Me, but when I went to Target earlier, they didn't have the shade that the girl had used, and we looked about the same complexion, so I was like, okay. I'm just going to... I'm just gonna use this. Let me make sure my under eye is all the way blended out. Cause you don't wanna set any creases. Oh my goodness. Oh my, oh my goodness, did I use too much? Oh my goodness, did I ruin my makeup? Oh my goodness, we're just we're just gonna keep we're just gonna keep on. You know what? No, we're not. We're, I'm gonna. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. I feel like I just ruined my makeup. <laughs> I feel like I just ruined it. Let's let's. Maybe I put too much. Hold on. Maybe I put too much. We're just going to blend it into the skin. Am I? Ooh. On camera, it looks a bit odd. So she said everywhere she put her concealer. I think that's what it was. I think I had grabbed a little too much because I, I feel like I'm looking ghostly right now. But let's see if I could let's see if I could save it. Let's see if I could save it, y'all. Oh no, I'm actually very scared. Cause on camera I look ghostly. And if this does not work for me, not only am I going to return it. I'm gonna have to redo my entire face. So let's just keep on going. Let's just keep on going. Let's not lose, let's not lose faith right now. Let's not lose faith. And then she went in with the loose setting powder as well. Okay. I'm so nervous. I really <laughs> Right now, I feel like I have to trust the process, <laughs> and I'm scared. What if it look bad? <gasps> what if this come out looking bad? I should have went to a different store and got some Maybelline instead. <laughs> ah! I look ghostly. <laughs> oh my gosh, I look so ghostly. It's not funny at all. Maybe this is more of a trust the process for me on my end. She knows what the fuck she's doing. I'm trying to make a product I've never used before. I think I don't mess it up, y'all. Okay, now she's going to, and now she's setting the rest of her face. I think she said she's using Mocha Mommy by Fenty. I'm going to use, whatchamacallit, I'm going to use Juvia's Place Bronzed in Deep Dark. This particular, I'm gonna be using this one right here. Listen, I'm so nervous, y'all. I don't, I'm just gonna use the same brush. My under eye just looks so bright. Maybe when I spray it with the setting powder, it'll probably melt into the skin. She did her eyebrows and her eyes off camera. I'm going to do the same. I'm gonna do my eyebrows, eyeshadow, put my lashes on off camera, and maybe by the time I come back, everything would have settled in. I'm gonna also go ahead and spray maybe a couple more times 
and hopefully by that time the powder has would have melted into my skin and not be sitting on top of my skin based off what i can see i think it's actually you know it's biggest of Super Bowl, but the difference is it's just two guys playing shit that they did in the studio. Niggas usually send their verses back to me and they be terrible, just like a two year old. I love a dinner with some fine women when they start debating about who to go. And I'm like, go ahead, say it then. Who to go? Who to go? Who to go? Who to go? Who you bitches really rooting for? Like a kid that had been from January to November, nigga, it's just you and Cole. Niggas so thirsty to put me a beef Got set in my words and start looking too deep I look at the tweets and start sucking my teeth I'm letting it rock cause I love them to see I still wanna give me a song where I be Can't trust everything that you saw on IG Just know if I diss you I make sure you know that I hit you Like I'm on your call ID I'm naming the album to fall off It's pretty ironic cause it ain't no fall off for me Still in this bitch getting bigger They waiting on the kid to come drop like a father to be Love when they argue the hardest MC Is it can't die, is it all we me? We the big three like we started a league But right now I feel like Muhammad Ali yeah, Muhammad Ali, the one that they call when they shit ain't connected no more Feel like I got a job in IT Rhyming with me is the biggest mistake The Spider-Man meme is me looking at Drake It's like we recruited your homies to be demon deacons We got them attending your wake Hey, how the gang got away from the bars, man, and shit like a prison escape Everybody steppers, we're fucking and everybody breakfast And I'm about to clear my plate I show up as motion picture blockbuster. Go with the golden pen, the top toucher. The spot rusher. Spray the toe shit up, the crop duster. Not rusher, but apply pressure to your cranium. My cold's automatic when aiming on with the boy in the status of stadium. Nigga. I'm not done. Yeah. I'm about to click out on this shit, I'm about to click, boom. I'm down to click out on you hoes and make a crime scene. I click the trigger on a stick like a high beam. And I was Benny Will when I was 19. She called my number, leave her hanging, she got dry clean. She got an Android, her messages is lime green. I searched one name and end up seeing 20 teams. Nadine, Christine, Justine, Kathleen, Charlene, Pauline, Claudine. Man, I pack them in this phone like some sardines. And they send me naked pictures, it's a small. All right, y'all, that wraps up this video. Please comment down below how the makeup looks, how it turned out. I was able to fix it at the end of the day. Well, I was able to fix it towards the end. I sprayed this bad boy twice, this in combination with this. Listen, babe. If you don't have a fan when you're doing your makeup, you need one, okay? You need a fan. All that, no, it's 2024, get you a fan. So this is how my makeup looks. This is how it turns out. So if you guys like today's video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys at the next one. Bye.